I was so afraid. When I walked in, I was so afraid. A lot of the people that come through our doors are uh, feeling a profound sense of isolation. I was certain that I was going to not be going home after this appointment. I was certain I was gonna be either going in an ambulance or a police car to the hospital. I feel sad and helpless because I care about people and our, our community and these seniors who have nobody. When people walk into MHRP for the first time. When people walk through the doors. We want them to feel safe, heard. That they are accepted, that there is no judgment. We are here to listen and we are here to provide support. I want them to know that they're welcome in our family and in our home. We want them to feel like they are beginning a relationship with us. We want them to feel like they belong. When that person comes in the door that is not in the world's greatest moods, not in the world's greatest place, I think that, you know what, inside that person is a good person. And all we have to do is do our best to get that good person out. We're part of the solution and simply not going to be a stop on, a, on an endless revolving door of no, not here, try next door. Um, we want to be a part of a relationship. We want people to feel connected to us in that way. So when I walk through the doors here, I am greeted with staff that are happy, they care, and they're very considerate and respectful. It takes a, a society to help change society. It's not about one individual or one government or one anything. We must work together to help each other out. Honestly, don't think I would be here without this organization. Yeah, it's made all of the difference in my life. I would like to say a heartfelt thank you. We are so grateful and appreciative of the support we have from United Way. Community donors are often the lifeblood of places like us. These programs are absolutely what changed my life.